Muy buenas a todos amigos, soy Black, ¿qué tal estáis? Y bienvenidos una vez más al canal Hoy os traigo un vídeo increíble Gracias a Betway pude grabar con el equipo de ninjas y pijamas con todos ellos Este es el primer vídeo, grabo con tres de ellos Con Dennis, con Red y con Lecro Y básicamente les pregunto cosas que me decís a mí día a día Va a haber dos secciones en este vídeo La primera van a ser cosas del juego, ¿vale? Que siempre me decís, oye Black, ¿qué pasa con Covers? Bueno, ¿qué te parece el escudo como arma en el juego? Todas esas preguntas que me decís se las he planteado a ellos Y la segunda es acerca sobre todo para la gente que está empezando en CSGO ¿Cómo mejorar el line? ¿Cómo mejorar el game sense? ¿Qué hacéis cuando os tiltáis en una partida? Y yo creo que ha quedado un vídeo bastante bueno y espero de corazón que lo disfrutéis Así que chicos y chicas, aquí tenéis el vídeo con NIP ¡Let's go! Okay, so now we are going to talk about the game things, about the question my subscriber asked. Well, Theo said uh, like months ago that Valve is going to do something crazy. What do you think about it? Do you know what could it be? Uh, I'm not sure actually, uh, but the 128 tick servers would be pretty good. Yeah, <laughs> <For average making. laughs> yeah. that will improve a lot of the yeah. game. So, what would you want in the game, for instance? What do you will happy with what? Uh, I'm not sure if they're gonna make like if they're gonna make a big change, but uh, right now I think they're doing a good job with fixing small things all the yeah. time. I think uh, they're more involved than in the beginning, so I think it's really good uh, from them to mm -hmm. uh, help the game out a lot. I think. I think so. Well, I think they, they could uh, bring some more money into the majors. <laughs> <laughs> they could. They yeah, could. They should. You deserve <laughs> that. Absolutely. Well, uh, one week ago, uh, Valve uh, put the seal in the game, only Battle Royale. Yeah. What do you think about it? Do you think that it could be in competitive mode or is impossible? Definitely not, because <laughs> we saw Please. this, like, we, we have example from 1.6. Yeah. And, and uh, I think every tournament banned it from every, like, you couldn't even play with it, so. No. I was imagining, <laughs> for instance, imagine Pop Dog, one guy with the seal there. <laughs> it's impossible, <laughs> it's impossible to do. No, so, I think it's pretty game-breaking, it shouldn't be there. <laughs> and would you like new weapons? For instance, they put, like, the uh, last one was MP5, but you don't use it. So you prefer, I think you prefer other weapons, so. Maybe like, but I don't think really we we don't. We, I think we don't need a new weapon. You're okay with that? Yeah. 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 Okay. So the next question is, what weapon will you improve and what weapon will you nerf? Um, I would nerf the AUG, or not? Maybe not the AUG, but the price. I would change the price, and uh, I would buff the M4A1, even though it has 25 bullets now. It's not. It's not enough. No. The, the, what do you call it? The fire rate. You need to yeah, the, the fire rate. rate. Uh, so about the elf, I want to ask you because you know the elf had the price like uh, <laughs> yeah. they change it and you are now okay. It's, it's really good, so we can use it. So do you think they have to uh, to you know to raise it? Raise the yeah, money. They need to raise Thank the you. Price, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, like at least I think it's uh, 3.3 now. Yeah, maybe 3.5 ish. Yeah, yeah. at least. Um, the next question is, uh, what do you think? Why Coverson is taking too long to be in the game? Um, it's hard to say. I think Valve has been working a lot on it, probably. But um, I think they wanna since they wanted to bring Vertigo in, yeah. and I think they're still rebuilding cash. I think uh, it might take some more time. I'm not sure unless they what? like to make a double swap later on with cash and cobblestone. It's a possibility, but yes. I think it's they're rebuilding cash. I've seen like FM phone or the, what is called the, the showed some pictures and stuff. Yeah, I think the map is like eighty percent done, so it's only yeah. the mid the, the part of the, yeah. what the mid part of the map. Yeah. And do you think that cash need the reward or not? I don't think so. Um, I think it was fine as it was. Uh, I think it was really good, but uh, uh, I don't know. It's hard to say. I think uh, you could do a lot of things on it. I think it was good as it was, but uh, apparently not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it could be fun with a change. I mean, it's been in the pool for very long, so a change could be fun, but it could also be very bad. And about Vertigo, do you like? Do you think they could like? 
yeah. you know it's not it's not a good enough <laughs> not for it, us like for the... yeah but it's for me at least not fun to play it's like fun maybe fun to watch but not fun to play i think it's gonna be very hard to watch like it's gonna be chaos it's uh, like so fast so close combat everywhere it's gonna be hard. so do you think the next major won't be very big on the map if hopefully the, um, i think it will be there yeah but it's not gonna be played too much i believe yeah okay so the last question they ask me this question every day when do you think sword 2 is going to be in the game do you think it's oh, close oh. or not <laughs> because well what i think if they put the source of source two, sorry, the the game is going to change a lot. Yeah. So I think in the next five years, maybe <laughs> I don't know. I know. I think Panorama was like a big step up, and uh, hopefully source two. I don't. I'm not sure what source two really is, but I know that Dota uses it. It's like the I graphic think, change. Yeah, there's a lot of graphic change, and I think the. Yeah, textures as well. It will be like more like battlefield probably, but I'm not sure. <laughs> Hopefully, it, it, it isn't that much change. Uh -huh. uh, yeah. Like it's it, CS:GO is fine as it is, and I think Panorama fixed a lot of issues, but there's still like some optimi optimization problems there and there. But yeah, I'm not sure when Source Two is coming. But yeah, they're not gonna um, put a new ending into the game like before it dies, mm -hmm. because if they do that, they could kill it. So the first question is going to be about uh, tips. Yeah. What did you do to improve your aim? Uh, what I did is I played a lot on a map called Aimbots. Uh -huh. uh, it's uh, the free workshop map uh, by yeah, yeah. Let's Go. Uh, so you can basically set up anything, like you, you have all the guns you can practice with. And uh, I like to do a lot of like flick shots with my yeah. when I practice because that big brings like the upgrades. <laughs> upgrades. <laughs> that, I'm uh, over. Uh, <laughs> uh, like when uh, I can build my muscle memory really easily uh, by like just flicking, and that helps me when I go into a match. Like then my aim will be more on point mm -hmm. when I just like practice my muscle memory pretty much. And do you play free for all or that kind of stuff, or do you only prefer aimbots? I only prefer aimbots because when I play deathmatch I just get more I get triggered because <laughs> I always get killed in the back uh, and there's all, always some guy that tries to knife you or something and mm -hmm. I don't think it's that fun so I try to keep me keep myself on the aimbots map. Yeah that's nice. <laughs> so Dennis uh, how do you improve your game sense? There is some tricks or you um, play I think you have to play a lot of parts and just keep playing, playing with people that you want to improve with. Mm -hmm. It's important and then you just go in to the role you like and just just keep playing. Yeah, keep playing yeah. every day, that's how every you improve. Every day, yeah. all the time. You have to play a lot. Yes. Mm -hmm. Because people is like, I play one, two games, it's not it's enough. It's not enough, like you have to play. So, oh. this question is, they ask me a lot. Uh, like, uh, like, what do you do? when you are killed. <laughs> so to keep calm, so we can win the match, what do you do? Instead of uh, trying to tilt others, you just keep it inside. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do. Just pass the desk. <laughs> <laughs> and what do you do when someone of your team is like, you know that he still, maybe he does something that... I think the easiest uh, way to get rid of the tilt is just playing better. Uh, I think uh, when you're tilted, uh, you should just focus more yeah. and just uh, <coughs> until you win rounds, you go, it's gonna loosen up. But uh, if you're vocal about it and stuff like that, it's just gonna get worse in-game for everyone. But I think uh, it's better than if you're tilt, don't say anything and just keep focusing. Just, uh, I mean, like don't talk about uh, what you're tilt about, but just focus on the gameplay. Yeah, that is just laughing. I don't yeah, know. Why. Yeah, 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 like, like if you need to say things, if you need to curse, then don't talk in the microphone. <laughs> so the next question is: some tips you can bring us to improve, um, like your general gameplay, or yeah. Uh, Im imagine we are talking while well, we are speaking to well, yeah. talking uh, to matchmaking people. Yeah, but I think you can improve very easily by just watching all these games, <coughs> like now on Blast. Like, just watch the games, and uh, mm -hmm. if you have a position that you play, like A or Mirage, you can play. You can just look at uh, pro players playing that site, so you can mm -hmm. just get some tips and tricks from them. 
because they are yeah they are pro and they're playing that so side for a reason. So you watching a lot of demos. Yeah, watching demos and just analyze like like pick a few things from every player and like you see what you like and you don't like and why do he does why does he do that and why doesn't he do that? Like you can pick up a, a lot of things just by watching a game. What do you think is better to learn? Playing solo queue or playing with a team? With a team uh, or with your mates. Like you play with the same core and you just uh, just play together, become better and just keep going. So people who is trying to get reach global, do you recommend them to play with you know? Yeah, with good friends. I mean, if you play with friends who aren't as good as you and trying to reach global, then you're not gonna make it, I guess. <laughs> not laughing so. I think it's better to play with people you know. <laughs> so. It was a pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Nice to meet you. Y espero que hayáis disfrutado del vídeo y ahora viene también lo que todos muchos habéis pedido. Ese quien quiere ser millonario con Gerrit y Forrest. Un saludo y hasta la próxima. Un saludo. Bueno, yo no es